So basically, why did I set the novel in Maine? Very, because for me it was very easy, because I know Maine very well. Uh, I've spent a lot of time there. I used to go to Maine every, every summer when I was a kid. And uh, that's my sixth novel. And uh, the fifth before were all set in France, in Switzerland, in Europe. And I really wanted to, to try somewhere else to think out of the box. And for me, it was something very normal and easy because I knew Maine very, very well and I was feeling like I was very able to, to share the atmosphere and the landscape with the readers. The reason why the, the novel is partially set in 1975 is because the action, the main action is set in 2008 and uh, I needed to have like a few years back and uh, a past and a history so I just like count the years before and uh, it happened that the, the disappearance of the girl happened 30 years before and that's how I ended up having a part of the story in 1975. But the previous novel, my fifth novel, was set during the World War II between 1940 and 1944. And a lot of people ask me, but yeah, why is your novel like speaking about, like, it's about something you were even born. So for me, it was very important that the main action uh, of the next one, of uh, The Truth About Harry Cabot's Affair, would be set in a moment where, like, where I was alive, you know, a moment that would like be con contemporary for, for me. And that's why I decided to set the story in 2008, because I started to write it in 2009, and uh, I just had to go years, few years before few years back.